Chongqing is a city surrounded by mountains and rivers, and it's this topography that gives the city its unique charm. Following the liberation of Chongqing in November 1949, the ruinous state of the city meant that economic development was a top priority. Since Chongqing has a complicated landscape, the development of transport infrastructure was key. Hello everyone, I'm Li Jue from Chongqing. Hi, I'm James from the UK. At the moment, we're on an ordinary train going from Chongqing to Chengdu. James, do you know this real life we are on is anything but ordinary? I know. It's the first rail road built after the founding of New China. That's right. It has played a vital role in transportation in the southwest of China for almost 70 years. The people of Chongqing and Sichuan began construction of the Chengdu Chongqing Railroad under leadership of the Southwest Bureau of the Communist Party of China Central Committee in June 1950. Sun Yixuan, a then 17-year-old staff officer of the 1st Military Industrial Road Construction Corps of the Southwest Military Region, was assigned by the Army and participated in the whole construction process of the Chengdu-Chongqing Railway. I heard that the 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 land was in ruin, and there was hardly any capital or technology available. The idea of building a railway was far easier said than done. So the first issue to be resolved was the lack of raw materials needed for the huge quantity of steel rails. We're at the Industrial Museum of Dadako District on the former site of the Chongqing Iron and Steel Mill. Next to me here is a steam engine that used to press steel and it's a treasured exhibit of the museum. In 1952, the first reel was successfully produced here, weighing 38 kilograms per meter of length. This mill assured that the materials needed for the Chengyu Railway were all produced locally from reels to boats. Now我们现在大家看到的就是中华市三十八公斤重轨，用于到了新中国第一条铁路陈榆铁路的建设当中。那当时呢，是在一九五二年四月十日的时候，一零一场提前十一天完成供应了陈榆铁路五百零五公里
The entire length of the 505 km Chengdu Chongqing Railway was finally connected on July 1, 1952. The connection of this railroad shortened the travel time between Chengdu and Chongqing from 48 to 12 hours, which sped up the flow of freight and passengers in western China, promoted economic prosperity and consigned the era when Sichuan and Chongqing had no railroads to history.